Riley, what's up, buddy? Just some progress notes on your ADA MP1 here. So someone went in and upgraded your EEPROM. And uh, while it doesn't change tone, it, what it does is allow you to have uh, quicker foot switch patch changes. So that's nice. Uh, I installed a new battery holder. Two lovely new Nichicons for your uh, filter supply. Um, these two items, which were installed by the prior tech, are going to stay. They're still good. What else can I tell you? Uh, two new preamp tubes. Your <clears throat> electrolytics here on the tube board. Test fine. No major ripple or ESR to be concerned with. Your input jack. Um, I thought we might be able to, to do a conversion to the kind that's sitting in, uh, in in mine, which is now a donor unit, but I can't. The, uh, the PCB boards are different because of changes made during the revisions. And yours is actually a 1.3. And you know, mine's a 2.01. So there's that. So what did I do? Uh, these don't exist anymore. You know, there's a guy in Europe um, who's, uh, I think he's a site admin for the ADA Depot, uh, Marshall JMP, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, he usually supplies these things, but he's out. So I literally had to disassemble this thing and what a nightmare and uh, reassemble it. There's, uh, you'll notice there's no more goop on it. So I was able to uh, remove the hot glue that the other gentleman left in there. So uh, I literally disassembled this uh, switch after removing it from the board and uh, reassembled it. And that's when you just, <laughs> that's when you're just praying because there's just nothing you can do. And it really, it's a Hail Mary. I mean, it wasn't working prior. So I said, let's give it a whirl and it's working. So how long, who knows? And so far, that's it. I think that's as far as I'm going to take her. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, one other thing. Yeah, I, I did uh, reinstall your other output jack. Um, I just took one off of mine. You're welcome to it. Uh, what else can I tell you? Hmm. Um, that's about it, man. She's holding presets now. Let's check it out. She was actually able to uh, load and store the factory presets. Look at that. That's beautiful. Exactly where I left her. I like it. That's a little easier to look at. Let's see if I can get it to re reboot here. So remember, I left her on 128. No more cycling through presets. No more error messages. So you're good to go. I'm probably going to... Yeah, you know what, man? I'm going to give you my knobs. Can't get these anymore, buddy. You're out there playing. You take them, buddy. So, update soon. Try to get some sound samples out of this guy. As we move forward and progress. Bye.